I was on vacation last week, there was a pool at our place, and it had the lazy river. And this lazy river had some ex- had awesome current. I mean, you sit on it, and you were like, woo! You were going. And it took you. It took you. And me and my boys and my wife were riding it, you know, surfing it and doing all the things in the lazy river and just enjoying it. And then one of our last days there, I was like, you know what? I've been eating too much. I need to kind of work out. So let me see if I can walk against the current. And at first, it was really hard. I could do it. But, boy, it took hard steps to go against the current. And I tried with every step to go against the current. And I was making myself around against the current. But it was hard. The current kept trying to want to push me in a different direction. And then my boy saw, oh, Dad, that looks kind of cool. Let's go against the current with you. So there was me and the bow block boys, you know, trying to go against the current. And we kept going against the current. And guess what? We started picking up speed. And we kept picking up more speed. I was like, boy, this is really getting easy. What's going on? Like, what happened to the current? Did they turn it off? And I looked down, there's still bubbles. And all of a sudden I realized something. We changed the current. We fought it and we turned it around. Why? Because we decided to walk against it. My friends, I know we're all not happy with the current of our world. But we are not going to change the current by trying to win every single debate with every person we disagree with. That's not our goal. You want to change the current? You need to pursue righteousness. We need to pursue righteousness that is focused on building kingdom-focused communities. That sees every person as valuable and loved and provides an opportunity by my words and by how I treat them and how I respond to them to open up the door for them to hear the message of Jesus himself. Because he's the one who can change hearts and minds. And my friends, when we work together at pursuing righteousness individually and collectively, we can change the current. But we got to work together. And it starts relationship by relationship, person by person. How we respond to them, even when we disagree with them. We have a higher calling to live out God's kingdom in this world and guide people to him. Are you with me?